Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be going over everything that is in our kids' activity boxes. I've gotten a lot of questions since I posted on TikTok, all of the things that I made for my wedding, and including in that was the activity boxes for the kids' table. In reality, kids are actually not invited to our wedding. The only kids that are going are our nieces and nephews who are in the wedding. We decided to just not have kids because just on my dad's side alone, there are 15 kids under the age of 14 and that would have just added to the numbers. Also because it is open bar and it's kind of a late night, we decided to not have kids invited to our wedding. And fortunately enough, our guests were pretty much okay with it. All of, I have cousins that were like, we're so excited for a night out without our kids. Fortunately, there are people who do understand and actually recognize that it'll be much more of an enjoyable night without kids. And then they respect our decision to not invite any that are not our nieces or nephews that are in the wedding. These are kids activity boxes. This one says Ryder. This is my youngest nephew on my side um, and I will show you what is inside. These boxes are from Amazon. It comes in a pack with more than enough that you'll need. I will have them all linked below. On it we just to keep everything in order and because the kids are not getting place cards we put their names on their boxes and we just used vinyl from the Cricut. Inside this is what it will look like. Lots of entertainment and lots of fun things for the kids to enjoy. So I have seven nephews and one niece and they all love Legos so much so we're kind of bribing them with these Legos but essentially you can find a template off of Pinterest to make a heart and it tells you what sizes you need. If you see these are all of our wedding colors. We got pink, we got gray, and we got blue. Um, for some reason my mom couldn't find the pieces in the middle to match which honestly you could have done two smaller pieces but that's beside the point so we printed off a we love you I would have done it maybe a little bit different but this is what she did and I appreciate her help to get all the kids boxes so the kids will really enjoy these um, obviously they probably won't stay in the shape of a heart which is totally fine with me Next, we have these activity books. We did not make these. We found these on Amazon, and you can get them in a pack, and it has coloring pages, spot the difference, uh, word searches. They have a bunch of stuff that will keep them entertained, at least for a little bit, maybe during dinner um, before all the dancing and stuff happens. Um, and, of course, they're all wedding-related, and um, I really liked the touch of it being gold that will match all our decor and it's just kind of prettier than um, having a full-on coloring page set out along with that we have this little crayon box um, it actually came with the original brown color my mom covered it with a white sticker to cover the brown so it kind of matched better the blue matches our wedding colors and then she went in with the pink you can barely see that has the names on it so there's no mix-ups and no one uh, has any meltdowns also there is a pencil sharpener at the top so it gives them a few colors to choose from when they're doing their activity books Next thing my mom ordered was these little pouches that actually are tic-tac-toe on the back. Um, and they come with these little pieces that have tic-tac-toe. Obviously, every single one, every person has their own, just so it's fair, but the kids will play with each other and um, that'll also help keep them entertained for open dancing. And this is something that I could have made, but I'm kind of glad that I didn't have to make something so little and detailed that I, it's just better that we paid for it and it was purchased off of Etsy. I took all this stuff out of the pouch. My mom put it in a little pouch and wrapped it in tissue paper just so it was prettier in the box. But we have just some snacks for the kids to snack on for the night because you know how kids are. They might like dinner, they might not like dinner. It just depends on their mood and um, this will keep them good and happy and full for the night. That was everything in our kids' activity boxes. It really isn't that much. It's just um, enough for them to stay entertained for the short period of time between dinner and open dancing. And so this was a really great and easy way to find things for them to be entertained. And honestly, I can't take very much credit for this. My mom did all of this because as far as I, it was, it was not something that I really cared about um, at all. Obviously, I wanted my nieces and nephews to be entertained. Um, as far as customizing things and making things detailed, that was all on my mother and I appreciate her hard work so that that was one less thing that I have to worry about or do our kids will be very happy and entertained with that said this is the whole video everything was pretty short and simple because I mean there was not much to it not much explaining uh, how to make the activity boxes because essentially they were just made on the Cricut like anything else in in the font Aisha demo which I the, that is the cursive font that I have used for my wedding this whole time Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. I think in my next video I will be married if I'm not already. <laughs> um, we are getting close and I don't know what videos are going up when. It just depends on the time frame that I have and I'm a little overwhelmed because I'm two weeks out from my wedding. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.